Here at our ministry center on Capitol Hill, I wish I could show you what is happening outside our front doors, literally within paces of our front door. The President of the United States has just arrived in the neighborhood. He is here to attend the investiture ceremony, the formal reception of the 112th Justice of the Supreme Court, which of course the court is right across the street. And Elena Kagan, uh, who is the newest member of the court, is being formally received today. Now, she was sworn in back in August, started her work already on the court. But today is all of the pomp and the circumstance. The Chief Justice formally receives her, and the President is in attendance because, of course, he nominated her to that position. And she was his Solicitor General in the White House, uh, which means she was the lawyer that represented the President and the executive branch before the court itself. That's why she's going to have to sit out a few of the cases, which she argued as a lawyer. So she can't sit in now as the judge. She has to opt out of those. It's called recusal, and she's going to step away from those cases. So she won't be on several of the cases at the beginning of the court's new term, which always begins first Monday in October every year. The Sunday before, a lot of the justices attend the Red Mass, which is a traditional service held at St. Matthew's Cathedral. We'll see how many of them show up for that service this year. And, uh, you know, it's always an elaborate thing. It's always impressive when the president comes to the neighborhood. doesn't matter who he is, uh, what party he represents. It makes you proud of your country. Just to see this, it's really impressive. Probably over 20 vehicles. Of course, a large security detail is dispatched. You have communications, support trucks and uh, vans and equipment that come. You have quite a large entourage of staff that travel with the president. And then you have emergency vehicles and so forth. Always very impressive. I may be able to show you a little clip of it, but we made a promise we wouldn't make the jobs of the Secret Service more complicated than they already are. So, uh, but it's a rare day when the president comes to the neighborhood, thought we'd share it with you.